Hi Durga. Hi sir. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, okay Durga, quickly introduce yourself. Oh, okay sir, thanks for giving the opportunity. My name is Sai Durga. Basically, I am from Kama. Currently, I am studying in Hyderabad due to coaching. I have a professional experience in 2 years, 5 months in Vipro company. And I have a technical skills like Java and testing, both automation and manual testing. And my hobbies are watching TV and playing, cooking. Okay, so what about your technical skills? Java and testing, sir, software testing. Okay, you are aware with both manual and automation? Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, uh, I can go with the first development process. Okay, sir. Okay. So, which development process you are aware of in SDLC? SDLC, sir. In SDLC, like there is a eight models. Yes, sir. Which model you can prefer? V model, sir. And uh, you know uh, Ajay? Yeah, yes, sir. Okay, so... Yeah, tell me, Ajay follows like which type of ceremonies? Four ceremonies are there follows that is the like sprint planning meeting, daily standard cars as scrum car, sprint review and sprint retrospective meeting. Okay. So what they are discussing in daily standard meeting? Daily standard cars after they are starting the developing the product, they will go with the daily standard cars, that is what they what they will do yesterday and what they went today. What any mistakes are done in yesterday, we can discuss all about in daily standard cars as scrum car. So you are mentioning that sprint retrospective yes, and sprint review. So what is mean by that sprint? Sprint is nothing but a um, particular work or particular time we will take that work. Okay. So generally what is the duration? Three to four weeks. Okay. Okay. That's enough. So in software testing, yeah. okay. So what is the advantages? So why we are doing the software testing in industry? Because of we go with the growth education and validation because of this developer product is correct or not in products and products and product basis. So that that time we can develop the product easily and we will test the product easily and we can get the reports as as best and as soon as. Okay. So the main advantage is so to reduce the failure risk. Yes. Okay. So what is meant by failure in your view? Human and mistakes, sir. Failure means a developer or any human, any doing it. So that is known as error. Yeah. What is failure? Failure is nothing but a, any, after developing the code, any tester found any abnormal behavior, that is called as a failure. It is known as defect. Then failure. Okay. So if the end user getting yeah. any abnormal any behavior, abnormal behavior. so he was facing any issues in a real time environment. Yeah. So then the product is known as failure product. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, that's fine. So uh, how many levels of testing we have? Software testing and soft in software testing there is a two levels, static testing and live testing. Okay, in valid is okay. Uh, dynamic testing is also known as validation. Validation. Okay. In validation, how many levels of testing? Four so levels of testing we follow in validation. So what are the? Unit testing, integration testing, system testing, user activity testing. Okay, that's fine. So why we are naming white box testing and black box testing? Because of here, if developer are doing the testing, we don't have we call it as a white box testing. After developing after developer will test the code, then we go with the black box testing, that is tester will test the application, how developer will develop the code. Why test the developers also need to do testing? Because of if they have to, there is a chance to make a mistake in when they are developing the code, that time they go with the testing, white box testing. Okay. So is it mandatory to do? Yes, sir, because of if developer will do the testing, the tester will easily test the application to give the good reports. Okay. So you mentioned here knowledge in test case and test case review as well. Yeah. So what is mean by review? Review is nothing but after developing the product or after testing the product, we go with the review because of the, if the product, after testing, testing the product is correct or not, we go with the review. Okay. So, review is coming under validation technique or verification technique? Validation technique. After tester will test the application, then go with the review of them. Uh, I am saying, so review will conduct in each and every phase. Uh -huh. So, review can be done by QC team or QA team? QC team only. QC team involved in product based, mainly QA will involve this reviews. Okay. So you know what is inspection? Yes. Uh, 
Uh, inspection means? Inspection means they will check the when they developing the application, they will middle of the developing application, they go with the inspection, the value credentials are valid for case. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so in uh, in manual testing, so are you know aware about bug recycling? Yes, sir. Okay. So what are the main statuses we can find in the bug recycling? Open, assigning, open, fix, fixed, retest. And what is about deferred as per design? In assigning state only, deferred and as per they are coming. Okay. Deferred means, what is the meaning of deferred? Postponed. It is nothing but if there is any, if the bug is low reality or low severity, then they will go with the deferred and they will do the testing, high reality and high severity tasks. Yeah, okay. So, what is the meaning of bug leakage? Bug leakage? Bug leakage is nothing but when the bug is, and bug is coming in the user environment, they will known as a bug leakage. Okay, fine. So, uh, bug leakage is okay. So, in user acceptance testing, if user can find, it is known as yeah. leak. But what is meant by bug release? After test the testing the application, they, they, when, they, in a, when they will find the bug, they will go with the bug release test. Okay, not at all. So you said that deferred. Yeah. So there is a connection between deferred and bug release. Okay. So what is the connection? Okay, so mainly we can say, so if there is any low priority defect, so we need to fix in a niche tool, we are making as a bug release. Okay. okay, what we are saying deferred, it is nothing but a bug release. So we know there is a defect we are sending to the production environment is known as bug release. If bug leakage is nothing but if tester cannot find that bug, but user can find the bug. Okay. Yeah, uh, that's fine. So with simultaneously we require that automation testing also. Yeah. So what you know about automation testing? Why we are going for automation testing? Because of drawbacks of manual testing, that is the regression testing is not possible. If possible also it takes a long time. That's why you go with the manual testing to test the application easily. Okay. Tell me some like uh, test cases for pen. If, suppose we have a pen, how we will test means if, we, if the pen is usable the friend you are friendly or not, if it is the right long time or if it is coming in key long time or not, it is comfortable to write or not, we can go with the that test scenarios. There is a lot of test scenarios. Mention some more test scenarios. And what you said, these all are coming under non functional any functionality? Go with the brand, pen brands. Okay, it is also not functionality. So we need to go for it is writing or not. Yeah. Okay. So when we are if we are writing only in particular surface only not. So these are things we need to. Okay. Yeah. Okay. In artificial testing, which tool is you can prefer? Selenium. So is there uh, no like is there no tools for in market? Yeah, is there there many tools in our market, but Selenium is user friendly and it is a free of cost. That's why we go with the Selenium. That is the programming language support is most. That's why we go with the Selenium. Okay. So in Selenium also there is a four types of suits. Yeah. Which which one you can prefer? Selenium web drive. So presently which version is available in Selenium? Four point eight. Okay, you, you know about the three edition? Ah, yes, sir. Selenium ID, Selenium. No, no, I'm saying that in that web driver only there is a okay, no problem. Okay. So, what you know in web driver, still you are learning that things or recently you are starting? Still, I'm learning something. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, uh, if there is any chance to get a job and like uh, you, uh, you, need, you need to study the commercial tool like UTP and UFT, is it okay for you? Yes. So, which programming language we can use for UFT and UTP? Character, I don't know, but I think we are using Java programming language. Yes. That's fine. So, we are using scripting language, that is VBC. Yeah, okay. Yeah, uh, that's fine. Okay. Now, so I am going with that. Like, uh, yeah, uh, I am asking some simple questions in Selenium. Is it okay for you? Which type of testing we can do in Selenium? Like automation is enough. Like, uh, okay, okay, that's fine. So, which type of applications we can test? Web applications. Yes, web applications. Is it possible to do mobile application testing? No, sir. Yes, that's fine. Uh, we can test captures in automation? No, sir. Why? In Selenium, there is a disadvantage. 
OTPs can uh, validate in manually? Yes, sir. Okay. So, what is meant by security testing? Security testing is nothing but we will check the application security. Like, correct to use the application or not to go with the security. Okay, is there any types of security testing? Yes, authentication and authorization. Okay, that's fine. So, are you aware about any database testing? Uh, you know what is the definition of or database testing? Yes. What is that? You will go with the like uh, data velocity, data integrity and uh, data validity testing. Okay. That's fine. So performance testing, uh, are you know any tools for performance yeah. testing? Load run, stress, stress load and load. Okay, stress and load testing is yeah. that right? Yeah. Any tool? J-meter. Okay. So you have any experience on it? No. Sir. If you are getting a chance for working with performance testing, yeah. is it okay? Yeah, uh, that's fine. So simply you can say, so web driver in Java is it interface or class or method? It is interface. Okay. Which type of subclasses are available in web driver? Pro driver. Okay. Get driver. Okay. Firefox. Okay, that's fine. So uh, tell me simple five methods in web driver. Get handle, get window handles, get window handles, switch to and navigate, maximize. Management is not a method of web driver. It is the subcommand of management. Okay. You can say get and navigate. Okay, yeah. Get text, get title. Get text is a web element function. Okay. Okay. So you need to like uh, uh, don't confuse about it. Okay. So what is the difference between get and navigate? Get is nothing but you will get the URL of the page. Navigate is nothing but navigate one page to another page. Okay, that's fine. So what is the difference between close and quit? Close means that will close them only in the current window. Quit means all windows they will be closed. Fine. Yeah, okay. So, uh, so uh, next round we can go for the some more automation questions. So, yeah, okay. This is for this round. Okay. So, further configuration we will meet once again. Okay. Yeah, uh, thank you, Durga. Thank you for your time. Thank you.